Welcome back my friend to another reaction video. I hope you're having a good day and if you're not, I hope it gets better. This video is from Real Body Camps. Let's go ahead and watch the video and see what it's all about. Let's go! On October 15th, 2023, while on patrol, an officer in Ohio spotted a black vehicle making an illegal U-turn at an intersection. After running the vehicle's plates, it was revealed that the plates had expired three months ago. Hello. How are you doing? Hi. So there's no U-turn back there? And also your plates are expired. Do you wear that? And yeah, I can get it because they tell me my like, You check? Yeah. Okay. All right, if I get it, uh, get, if I get the service, uh -huh. it'll be, uh, I can get them. Okay. Do you have um, insurance in the car? I do. Okay. Uh, let me just uh, run everything real quick. Okay. And I'll be right back. Okay. I appreciate it. Yes. All right. Miss. Yeah. Could you do me a favor? Can you hop on out real quick? Sure. No, not at all. Unless you want to be. No, not at all. Okay. All right, we're going to go on the sidewalk here real quick. All right, so I'm going to work with you a little bit, but you are going to get a citation, okay? okay. Just just for the plates um, being so far expired. Okay. Um, I'm not going to tow your car either. Um, mm -hmm. Also, provide that to the court that you have insurance, because okay. you have the insurance. And then I'll advise you on the U-turn as well. Okay. Um, the plates is the least. Um, egregious offense for everything. And then uh, I couldn't get a good look. Who's your passenger today? Um, that's my little sister. Little sister, how old is she? She's 16. 16, okay. Does she have a license or ID by chance, you know? No. No, okay. We just came from having food. Okay. Um, how much weed's in the car? Um, it's not like a little roach. I can a little roach, okay. That's what I said. It just smells like someone smoked. Sorry. So I'm just going to go through the car real quick. If it's just the roach, I'll just advise you on that. Okay. Um, I know you have a CCW. Do you have your firearm with you? I do. Okay. You're supposed to tell me that. Oh, sorry, I right. did um, right, know. Just wait there. Okay, this is my second time getting pulled over. Yeah, so whenever you make like contact with law enforcement, usually it's going to be in your car. Okay. You have to make us aware that you have your firearm, okay? okay. It's in, in my purse. Okay, um, just place your arms your side. I'm just going to make sure you got nothing else on you, okay? Mm -hmm. Doesn't look like it. Okay. What's your sister's name? Hi. Okay. Hi, ma'am. Can you do me a favor? Can you hop on out real quick? Am I in trouble? Nope. She just said there's a little roach in there. Um, just gonna search the car real quick. If it's, that's it, I'm just gonna advise you guys on that. How old are you? Um, Why are you telling me she's 16? She's. All right, so let's let's not lie. Let's just be honest. Do you guys are you guys related? No. No. I just came out here. Okay. So why is she? Well, she really don't want to be with me right now. Why so. is that? Because we had an altercation a long time ago. I don't know if it's in a the protection order or something. No, no it was just like we had an altercation. We got into with the police. No order, no law enforcement. Oh, then that that doesn't matter. Okay, I mean, I'm sorry. I just didn't want to get us in trouble. No, well, we made amends. Okay, if you guys, if there's no sort of protection orders or anything like that, then that doesn't matter. You guys can I'm be. Sorry, I just didn't want to. Yeah, I got you. So, do you have an idea on you by no. chance? Okay. So. Do you know, uh, I don't know my social. you don't know your social? Okay. Do me a favor. Uh, what's your first name? D E D E. A hyphen. E R I C K A. Okay. Last name? Sanders. S A. Time and spelling. N D. Yes. Okay. I'm gonna pause real quick. Let's talk about this, babe. Oh. The girl gets pulled over, right? She got no license plates. No, I guess no insurance. Um, the police officer is going to give her a citation, right? Not even going to throw her car away. That's actually pretty good. But then he, she goes and uh, says that the passenger side is her little 16-year-old sister. Um, man, when the police officer pulled up to the passenger side, man, that did not look like a 16-year-old sister to me, man. I just, I don't know why she thought to say that, man. Like, that girl's going to say the truth that she ain't 16, right? Oh, uh, another thing, um, if you're going to smoke, man, don't be doing it in your car. Do it at home. Do it in your garage. I don't care, man, but don't be doing that. You're just going to cause yourself problems. Look. If she, if the police officer would have smelled something in the car bed, she would have gotten her citations on going on your way. You know what I mean? They wouldn't even be bothered with the passenger side, uh, passenger. But another thing, man, she says she lied because um, the guy had gotten into altercation, man. That's not good. Uh, uh, for an enemy's 
relationship right there you know let's let's go at it and then forgive each other and hang around with each other you know what i'm saying like that is that's something you see in a tv show or drama or, or something like that you know it's just people going at it and becoming friends again and stuff like that it's a very intriguing in a way but i don't know that police officer is gonna be nice to that driver Eddie board man for for what she just did like she's already considered in his mind a liar you know but I guess we're going to find out what happens, right? Let, let me know down below what you think up to this point, man, about this young ladies and police officers, man. But, uh, yeah. Uh, also, one more thing before I go, man, <laughs> or at least continue the video. She had a licensed uh, firearm with her, man. You got to tell the police officer when you pull over you have one because a lot of police officers don't know that. And if for some reason it would have been out, like in the, she says it's in the purse, if it police officer would have seen it she, he would have like reacted really fast like hey you know so get out the car you know what i'm saying he said like you gotta let him know i'm sure they tell you that when you get a firearm right like if you get pulled over you gotta let the pol police officer know right away you got one man <laughs> all people be sleeping too much man no 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 okay um do you have a ccw by chance no okay just asking because she said she had a ccw uh she has her firearm with her she said it doesn't look like you have really any yeah. Pocket ring like that. What's in on there? Cell phone. phone. Okay. And your jacket pocket looks. Yeah, no. Okay. All right. Give me one second. Just hang out with him. Okay. This is my purse by chance. I mean. Okay. That's fine. As the officer ran the passenger's information through the system, he discovered the passenger had multiple active felony warrants in Ohio for serious charges, including aggravated robbery, felonious assault, and assault. All right, ma'am, you, um, have you ever had an ID or Ohio license or anything like that? No. No? Okay, what would be your most current address or where do you live at? I don't know, I feel good, I got a headache and I got a pee. Okay, I got you. All right, Derek, can you, can you come over here real quick with me? Derek, you, come here. Okay, um, this is all your information, you're being honest with me. Uh, the, only, the only reason why I ask is because you seem really hesitant on your date of birth and your address. Usually yeah. people are pretty quick with that, it just seemed like you hesitated with me. No. Um, do you have any warrants or anything like that? No. Nothing like that? No, 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 no. Okay. Alright. Oh, I got a pee on from the bird. Okay. Well, unfortunately I can't have you peeing in public. So right. I'm going to try to make this as soon as, 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 soon as I can. Yeah. Officers confiscated the marijuana located in the vehicle to be documented and destroyed. Can I leave? Because I gotta use it. No, you cannot leave. You are detained as of now. Why am I detained? Be no, you're being detained, which means during the course of a traffic stop, everybody in the vehicle is detained. And especially because there's an odor of marijuana, I have the right to identify who you are. What you mean? I just told you who I was. Well, so who's... I'm just letting you know, you're still not allowed to leave. I don't care what the issue is, but you're not allowed to leave. Steve, can you get her so she doesn't walk away? Why am I detained? I just told you why. Oh, stop. Come here. Jeez. Radio full Ooh. pursuit with the female. We're by eastbound. You're going to get taste. You must have missed. Uh, you <laughs> I got her. So move. Radio. Can we get some more cars? Block traffic. Stop that car. Okay, I I don't give a shit. I don't care, get up. My cell phone right here. Steve, grab us.
Radio, she's in custody. In custody, 2322. Now you're under arrest for resisting. So, you made everything worse. Get over here. It's over here. Stop. Okay. You are f***ing. Stop making it worse. It's tight. I don't care. Huh? 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 Yes, please. He got my phone. 6609 to 1916. Can I just call my kids? I will do everything you ask me to. I just need to call my kids. I don't care right now. Stop f***ing with the cuffs. I'm not. It's on my wrist and it's tight. Well, maybe you shouldn't run. Because you was pretending me for no fair reason. You know what I just thought right now? I'm, I'm, I gotta pause this. This is my, this is what I'm thinking. Um, The police officer ran that name that she gave him, right? And it said active warrant, active warrant. Um, But then he came back to her and, and, and said that she hesitated to give her birthday. So I guess since she gave the police officer a different name, not knowingly knowing that the person's name she gave had those active words, you know? Um, and then what happened is that she said she had to pee and her stomach was hurting because she probably thought she was going to get caught for not saying her real name or something like that. And she decided to take make, make a run for it, which was kind of stupid because that van almost hit her. And then uh, the I don't I think the police officer tried to taste her but missed. And then when they got to the other uh, street, like the two way, that their car was coming, so and, you know it honked and stuff. And she decided to kind of stop, or else she probably get hit by cars. And that's what made the police officer like get her, you know, and, and uh, catch her. But yeah, um, she, she that was a pretty smart man. But I think that's what I'm thinking, man. I don't know, I might be wrong or something, but I guess we're gonna find out because I th I think the police officer thinks she didn't give the right name, because I don't think she like if some if you get pulled. I'm I'm, I'm thinking that because if you get pulled with police officers, man, you know you got warrants and you give me your name, you can probably tell them, look, man, I got warrants, you know, or you might just want to start running at that moment before even giving your name, you know. So yeah, I think that's what happened. I don't think that's a real date. <laughs> <laughs> and the police officer, like, she got intimidated and decided to make a run for it, which is not smart because you will never run away from the police, mate. And even if for some reason you do do a miracle and get away, you're already in the system and stuff like that. The catch is gonna be worse. So I'm just saying, <laughs> own up to it, man. Own up. Stay with her. Make sure some of the cops and keep the door open. Can you get her? Can you walk? Let her walk over here to get my cell phone. All right, so what's her name? Oh. Bullshit, don't start with me, because this is bullshit now. I'm what's her name? Because you told me she's your sister. She ain't your sister. Honest, okay, I'm just, I can come to you right now as honest. I know her as Bubbles. I don't know exactly her real entire name. We was, okay. we was, we was friends in middle school. Can I finish? What we didn't, we didn't have this kind of class. 35, the rock side, no tree in our city. Her four, the four I know she has two kids. We were just catching up. I promise you, we was catching up. Who's Oh, you're and they just short. Yeah. Okay. Taking her over. All right. So either you can tell us who you are now, or you're just gonna sit in jail for about a month until they get your DNA back. Can I talk to my kids? No. I can not talk to my kids, and I'll do what you want me no. to do. No. We'll talk to your kids later. My priority right now is my business. Your kids are second to me right now. I need to figure out who you are and why you're running from me. You have warrants. Is that why? <laughs> They're my kids. Can you let her call my kids first, please? No, I will let you. Call, I will call the kids. Please, I'm begging you, you for a reason. Please, I'm a first-time mom. That's great, but I'm what is your first time mom? What's your first, first name? What's your first name? Please come right here, please. So here's the thing. You did this to yourself. I know. So, I would have been listen. Done, I'm a first time listen. Mom. Stop crying. You did this to yourself. So don't put I'm anybody. So don't try to make me feel responsible for your terrible decisions, okay? And I, and I promise to God I did. 
did this. I didn't do it to myself. You what? did. Then who did it? Who ran? Did someone control your legs to run? No. Then, it then who did about it? That. it was, I was thinking about my kid. Okay. Well, if you just told me who you were and everything, you could have went home. We could have been done with this. But now you're. My kid. All right. Well. Where's your phone? My kid. He has it. Has is your phone broken? Yes, you broke my phone. No, you broke it when you fell by running. Again, no, again listen, phone. listen, again. This is, this. these are your actions. I didn't tell you to run, did I? I didn't tell you to run in the middle of traffic, did I? Because I want this, I want this, I want this. Take responsibility for your own action. I will. And I'm not yelling at you and I'm not mad. I'm not. Do you, do you know her number for her kids? No, it's in her phone. That's why I asked her for her phone. The thing about it is, I just want my kids. I will tell you all exactly who I am. I just want to talk to my kids. I you're promise gonna I'm not going to get out. I'm not. You're going to have to tell us who you are regardless. I will tell you exactly who I am. If y'all just let her let me call my kids, I promise you. I promise you. I promise you. I promise. If you just let her let me call my kids, I promise I will tell y'all. I'm not saying this for no reason. I'm saying it because I'm a first time mom. Is there a password on this? <laughs> huh? It's broken. My phone is broken. Okay, so how am I supposed to call your kids if it's broken? Because she ha I will give her the number to call. <laughs> You're gonna have to go and sit in jail until we fingerprint you. It'll take about four days. We'll tell us who you are. We'll go from there. Okay? I or, was... or you can tell us who you are and then save us a whole lot of time and you a whole lot of time not being in jail. You'll go home to your kids, right? Okay, well, you're gonna have to fess up to who you are. Okay? You got some travel warrants or something? No. What do you got? Probation? Parole? Parole? Probation. Probation? Alright. So you didn't do it. You didn't do a bit. You're not, you're not been in prison, right? No. Alright. So we figure out who you are. What's your real social, kid? I don't, I don't know my social. All right, what's, your, what's your first and last name? No bullshit. Can you call my babies? All right. Um, just have them with this. Call it. Don't. We'll just. Here's your name. Well, the just ask if the babies are okay. Ida. The so they're Andy good. Adam Young. Last name is. Are they good? Paul Adam and the Robert. Right. Adam. Is grandma is that who was the kid? Yeah. She said they're fine. Four of ninety nine. I want to talk to my kids. Okay. Well, we'll worry about that later. Go ahead. Lock 44? So is this a passenger that you had me checking for earlier? Because I can't find that name in the paper. Yes, she was a liar. Copy that. Hello. Can you pat her down good? Yeah, you got an extra glove? I do. I ran out of mine tonight. Mm. I only have one left. So. Oh, I got one. Yeah. Thank you. So you got two warrants out of county? Yeah. Alright, you can stop out for me. You want me to look at her history and make sure she didn't f up between now and the time she got a permit? Yeah, if you could. Alright, you got the ID? Uh, it's, she's got it in her citation. Alright. So we just have that per the other girl, uh, yeah. falsification, and resisting. resisting arrest. I should have tased her. How far did she get? So she ran through here, through the bushes. She, I knew, because she was walking away and I There was three of you guys here. How was she going to get away? Ma'am, do you need an ambulance? Because you fell. Do you want her blunt as well? Yeah. So you don't need an ambulance? No? Great. Who's... Who's gonna claim ownership of the weed? I mean, I don't want her to get in any more trouble that she already in, so I guess I'll take it if it's just a ticket or whatever. Alright. Where do you want this for now? Because I'm not um, gonna hand it. In the glove compartment. I'm not gonna hand it to you, loaded. Alright, mag's in your purse, which is right in your front seat, and the gun is in the glove box. Okay. You have your ticket? Yes. You don't have to go to court if you want to, you can. You. Don't hang out with Bubbles anymore. Because <laughs> she's not a good influence.
The suspect was issued citations for resisting arrest and falsification. The suspect had previously been charged with aggravated robbery, two counts of robbery, felonious assault, and assault in 2021. The suspect's bond was set at $725, however she could not post bond and was taken to jail. At this time, the suspect's court case is still ongoing. What? Alright, you guys. Let's talk about this real quick. So, I guess that's what she, her stomach and stuff was hurting, right? And she had to, because she was about to make a rub for it. Another thing, I kind of thought she probably didn't say her real name at first because that police officer said something about her date. And I guess we found out that wasn't really her name because they were still trying to identify, identify who she was. I don't know how she was trying to make a deal with the police officers to let her talk to her kids so she could give them their... Her, ident her identity, which uh, even the police officer, I guess they were like, let's just let her talk to her kids so we can just get this over with and don't waste four days trying to see who she is, you know? I gotta say, though, man, that driver, uh, she got away. Like, she got lucky, man. I've seen other videos, so I don't know how it is in every state, but, like, if you got your, uh, if your license, you know, license arm or weapons holder, I don't think you're supposed to have a clip, loaded clip, and a bullet in the chamber, um, or at least not a clip, but a magazine, right? And then load a bullet in the chamber in your purse, <laughs> you know? I think, like, they're supposed to be separate in different places to where, you know, it's not all they ready to go. So I guess she got lucky, or I guess in that state, they, they just don't even drive, like, like give her a citation or something like that, because it looked like they just let her go with just a citation for no plates. Another thing, I thought she was going to get, uh, like, for um, obstruction, because she was lying a lot about her pass the passenger side, you know what I'm saying? Like in getting in the way of the identification by lying and stuff. So she, I think she got off really, really lucky that driver. Um, for the mama, I never heard of a first time mama when you got two kids, man. How does that work? You, you know how that works? I don't know how that works, man. Like if I have a baby with a, a female, I'm a first time daddy. But then if I have a baby with another female, I'm a first time daddy again. How does that work? I don't know how that works. That's the first time I heard that, but I don't know unless she has babies with two different guys. So she's a first time mama on both kids. I, I don't know. I'm just trying to like understand this new type of way people think. Um, but yeah, man, she was worried about her kids, man. She should have been worried about her kids before trying to do any type of stuff that got to got her those felonies and warrants. I'm I'm just saying, man, I'm that but oh you know, that police officer was really nice, man. Like Really nice police officer, but the way he handled the situation, he said I should have tased her. I guess he tried to tase her, but it changed his mind. He must be a good cop, man. I got to say it. Anyways, what did you think about this video? Let me know down below what you thought about these young ladies. Uh, the police officers, how they handled the situation. Also, hit the like button. It really helps this video out. Thank you for your time. Thank you for watching. Want to watch another video? You can watch this one right here, and I will see you. Next time. Bye.